Hi. How you been? I've been good. Hi, Linda. Linda is all shy. Hola. Hola, hola. Hola, hola. <laughs> you're gonna have to. You're gonna have to talk, Linda. You can't be shy here. No, you're not red. Hey, what? 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 been going on but it's getting better a ver, pues cuenten. <laughs> no pues no más y like we had issues with i don't know family oh, yeah family so uh, we ended up siempre si sí, dude this always but that's why like you know. but i don't know it's getting better so yeah ahorita like i started working at this other job i don't know if i told you estoy trabajando like for urgently it's like a roadside assistance Oh, cool. Dude, it's awesome because it's not inbound. It's not inbound calls. It's outbound. Yeah. So I can literally sit here and then like finally call someone and be like, hey, are you available for a tow? You know what I mean? Like ah. simple stuff like that. Yeah. And it's everywhere from New York, California, uh, Canada. So, so what exactly do you do there? So basically we get a, a case, right? And we open yeah. it up. And it tells you, oh, this person is stuck in the road. Oh, okay. And then you talk to the customer, let them know what's wrong with the vehicle and shit like that. And then once you talk to them, you start looking for providers. So somebody can go tow their vehicle or mm -hmm. help with whatever they need. So roadside assistance. Yeah. That's and cool. And then it, we just started working at, uh, what is Famous it? Dave. Famous Dave's. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> I like her. I like her job better. I, yes, <laughs> I know. I, 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 I what are you doing there? What do you do there? Spreading the ribs, the mm. todo pork, muffins. Oh, yeah. it's, a, it's a lot of work, pero mucho mejor. No sé, no caliente. Porque so, dónde trabajabas antes? Pues trabajando es corralito. Era cocinera. Ajá. O sea, cocinando para todos. <laughs> But I, uh, yeah, pues, yeah. Well, there you have like other cooks, no? Sí. Dos personas. Ya, ya, no, pues, ya tienes que ser casi cosola, haciendo de todo. Ay, no. Yeah. ¿Ya tenías mucho allá? Pues, creo que sí. No sé. Dos meses. Dos meses. <laughs> es mucho para mí. <laughs> Eso ya, ya no, no sé. No, ya era tiempo que cambiaras. Ah. Hey, guess what? I'm going to start trying to see if I can get pregnant. Well, I'm going to go to the gyno oh, first. Good. Yeah. That's exciting. Yeah. When are you going to start? Well, I need, I I made an appointment. Ay, ay. Ahorita. Oh, <laughs> That's cool, dude. Yeah, I made the appointment. I have it till October. Pero ya, yeah, like, hopefully. Yeah, yeah, me don't do it. It's around the corner. Get the way. See, dude, do you know, like, like how much stuff like that is? Like, in, like to go, like, well, I don't know, like, for insurance? Well, because then this on a baby. Huh? You want a baby? Want to baby? Yeah, her. But, uh, you know, I'm not going to go I, it's not easy for me because i'm not gonna go and be like oh you can't get me pregnant you know we'll see. like i literally have to go but it's expensive and i don't have insurance right now no yeah so. you would have to you're gonna get pregnant fast watch i, I hope so i hope so imagine me like pregnant you. bitch i'm gonna be so big <laughs> 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 yeah it's a recording. Yes, I think you have to howl. Hey, I was going to los tengo in the kennel or whatever. Yeah, I'll see. Mira, salte por la puerta y te hice un hoyito para que entres y salga. Te dejé agua, te dejé comida. Ay, para que me dejaras hacer record. That's funny, dude. ¿Qué te pasa? I know. Yeah. That's cool. I'm so excited for you. I know. I'm like, I had thought about it, huh? I know you've been wanting one. Yeah. At some point, I was like, but if it doesn't happen, <laughs> if it doesn't happen, pues ni modo, you know? You have proved that you fight well. Now you can join us. Keep copy. Wake up.
check your phone. Ignore the alarm, you're still alone. Wake up, rewind the night. Who are you? But also kind of who am I? Wake up, check your phone. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to F and Adult Team. We are back. My name is Lorena. And my name is Crystal. And this is my wife. Welcome, Linda. It's nice to be back and have Linda here with us. Yay. <laughs> Um, I know you wanted to talk about Anne Hedge. Yeah. Or whatever her name is. Yeah, okay. Anne Hedge, right? Yeah. Um, I, I, le- I kind of saw, I don't know if you saw the video of her, like, speeding. I saw all the video. Yeah, you saw everything? Yeah, because, yeah, yeah, I saw everything. I, I went into it because I got all into it, so. Okay, well, we'll get into that. But first, welcome, Linda. How do you feel? Oh, good. Yeah, it's on nervous. <laughs> How do you how do you feel doing the podcast with us? She's nervous. <laughs> Did Crystal tell you? Did she tell you like, hey, you want to join, or were you like, oh, can I get? No, she asked me. She asked sure. you. I did. <laughs> You're like I did. <laughs> I was like, you want to join us? It'll be cool. Uh, it goes anyway. <laughs> Aww. She was like, well, I'm nervous. We are always nervous. I get nervous still too. I don't as much anymore. Like the beginning, I remember I was more like, what do I do? <laughs> yeah. How do you guys meet? So me or you? You, babe. I, I. Why? So we both had a um, Facebook, you know, that dating Facebook thing dating. that they opened up. And I was, it was just like whatever, you know what I mean? Like, like every all my friends were there. So I was like, well, I'm going to add more friends that I already know, you know? And then I, I saw a picture of Linda. Uh huh. And I was like, La quiero para mí. <laughs> no, and then like, I just told her, like, I sent her a message, I believe. And I was like, I think you're really beautiful. Yeah. yeah so then, like, I think days passed, maybe a couple of days or something. And then she, she messaged me back. And then, what did you tell me? Like, same. Sí, le dije, same to you, el primero, porque ya ves que tienes que poner esta una X y una flecha. Y yo era de las que no ponía X, X y X y X. Ay, güey, she was like, X, X. Y luego pues, yo le acepté a ella, y de repente ya, que la acepté. Ajá. Pero yo casi ni lo usaba, Katie. No, whatever, ya, cuando fue leyendo el mensaje. Sí. Y lo decía, ¿cómo decía? I think you're really y beautiful. Y yo le dije, oh, same to you. So le dije, vamos a hacer esto en mi Facebook. You see, me mandó prayer request. Yeah, I love phone number. So, yo cuando se armó todo, ¿no? Yeah. <laughs> so, she just, she gave me her number and we started texting and then we were supposed to have a date, a first date, but she told me she was sick. Yeah. She was like, I'm sick. Yeah, no, that was, uh, remember I told her que me agüite because I was like. Oh, I think you told me. <laughs> Hey, Linda, Linda vino aquí, estaba hablando mucho, así como que, no, no sé, I don't even... Heard it, she heard it. Pero sí le dije que, pues, si quiere me pongo una máscara. No, well, sí, yeah, she did. Sí, una mask, o si no, y well, yo era, no, it's okay, uh, it's just something. Yeah, I was like, no, nah, it's, it's all right. Okay. She did the same Because I thought it was just an excuse, honestly, and I told yeah, her. Yeah, like, I thought it was just an excuse, like, so I didn't God, want to bother. Honestly, I was sick, me sentí así como... Oh, sí, como que... Pero algo, so... I know, and then so then I was kind of down on it, and then you see, I was so upset. negative. <laughs> and then, like, yeah, it's kind of a lot, so lo, se va lo negativo, la cristal. Well, I like nobody loves me. Nadie me quiere. Remember? Yeah, I, I think I told her another. You see, like, there's all these red flags. Oh, Oh, yeah, it's just like all these red flags, and I'm like, oh, my God. But they were sad on those red flags. Why? Well, yeah, because they were heart flags. They were heart red flags. Now we're married. I know that was good. That's good. Ya tienen cuánto? We have like yeah, ocho meses. Ocho meses, yeah. It's crazy. I was telling her why so fast? Who got pregnant or what? Es que me embarazó y dije que no. Pues me so sí, pero pues I was just like happy that you found someone. And she's a sweetheart. But yeah, it's, it's been hard 
Like, I'm not gonna lie, it's been hard. We have ups. But I mean, I think like as long as we can get through it together, and then. Sí, pues en el principio siempre lo mismo. That's how it is. Mm-hmm. Cabrón, vaya de primero. Well, especially if you don't have a place, you know, to go to. And then try just to. Monday. It adds more to it that you don't. Yeah, and then trying to you... adjust to someone that you don't, you never lived with, you know. Mm-hmm. Y también tú, like, and then having you like have your kids around someone, and you're like, okay, pues. Okay, you know, kids también. Exacto. So. The kids love me. Sí, but I. Ah, they love. They're so sweet. Y ahí te estamos en un picnic con ellos. Y más mi niña le digo, no pensé que la niña se le iba a acercar. Y de volada, pues ya me cambió, ¿no? <risa> mi hija ya. Y pues mi hijo, pues de volada, le. No era fácil para ellos, le. Que alguien se le acercara así, ¿no? Y con ella de volada. Pues que se enamora. Well, Lordy, freaking God. Let's talk about Anne Hesh. Um, I think she already passed away on Sunday, right? Dude, I didn't even know she died until last night. Because I knew she was in the hospital. But I didn't... Was in critical, critical condition. I think she was on life support and they took her off life support Sunday. Yeah, dude. It's just pretty crazy. I know I saw a video of... Uh, so, 10 minutes before the accident, she yeah. went to this guy's store to buy a red wig. A red wig? And the guy in a red wig, dude, and he was talking and he was like, she looked normal. She didn't look like she was on drugs or on alcohol. He's like, she was really sweet to me, actually. She said that she looked up and she's like, I want that wig. And he's like, do you want me to cut it? It's not even cut. Like, no, no, era nomás la wig. Y que le dijo, yeah, no, no, don't worry about it. I'll take it. Y que le dijo, well, it's full of dust, too. You don't want me to clean it for you? Y que le dijo, no. Don't even worry about it. Just sell me some shampoo and conditioner for it. Y que le dijo, oh, okay, ya se la vendió y todo. Y que estaba diciéndole ya él, oh, you're such a beautiful, you have a beautiful face. Y que le dijo, oh, thank mm-hmm. you. Y que le dijo, have we ever worked together? And he was like, no, we haven't. And I said, oh, but I'm available if you ever need to, you know, like I'll be more than happy to help you. Y dice que sí, que hasta they took a picture together, dude. The picture came out and everything. And she left, wow. and she left after that, and 10 minutes late, like, 10 minutes passed, and she crashed. So, like, I don't know, like. Well, was she being chased? Or well, that's the thing. She was that's the thing that people are trying to say that, okay, so basically her last movie that she was making was going to be about sex trafficking children. And so everybody's thinking, like, why is she go to the store and buy a red wig? And then she was. I heard. Okay, I heard that she had gone to do a podcast, and they had been drinking. Oh, I don't know. Honestly, that's what I heard. Look, I read it on. Um, it says, I think it says I'm a marca. It's amp dot Says Anne Hesh uh, was drinking copious amounts of vodka and wine in podcast before crash. She was also reportedly slurring her speech just hours before crashing. And then it says, um, But that's uh, weird though, because if the guy that she went to go buy a red wig from said she, yeah, he didn't say that, yeah, that she was normal. It's weird because they they say like the podcast, they are better together podcast or whatever. And and they have a video of the podcast, but they took it down. Hmm. But they had a video of her like talking to them and everything, and they had bottles. And it says, um, "We're sitting here with each. I mean, we each have a bottle in front of us because our friends send us a bottle, and then you know they just start talking and shit. And it says, "I once even did a terrible commercial for them." And we listened to the doctor's advice, and we're drinking it with wine chasers. So they were drinking. But they also said she had cocaine in her body. That's what I had. And yeah. it, but it's weird though because people like because cocaine will fucking bring like it'll you know, calm you down, and like be normal, like but you still yeah. smell like alcohol, especially if you're taking pictures with somebody so close, like yeah. you would smell them. 
but it's That's weird, funny. you know, and like a lot of people are saying that maybe I don't know, there's a lot of conspiracies going around, but so I don't know if you've seen the video of when they're actually moving her body from the accident. That she jumps. It looks like she's a zombie. They had her in a bag, dude. Like if she was dead, it was a. I googled it. I googled what does a body bag look like, and what does a fire blanket look like, like the burn blanket when you're burnt, because uh -huh. they were said she was burnt. So I googled all that, dude. It's white, just like the body bag that we saw that she was in, and she was completely closed into it. And if you notice on the top, she's strapped on the top, but because she's such a small woman like she came through the hole dude firefighter why are firefighters putting her in an ambulance like when it should have been paramedics y luego le, yeah. Yeah. El firefighter como que, no you're going back in like you know what i mean like she got up all crazy dude like she was going like that yes i saw that and she, I, I was like pausing it and zooming in to see if she looked burnt but mm -hmm. she i didn't see any burns well, she look, I don't, well, yeah, porque no se mira muy claro, pero si se mira que está. Yeah, she, she, she gets up, she's going like that, and then she gets up, dude, and I'm like, that's weird, like, I don't know. That's insane, though, because there's so many theories or so many things that you can think of if she's filming this, you know, supposed movie with trafficking and all that. That's crazy. I don't know. There's a lot of things they're saying, also that newer cars can be controlled from somewhere else and since she was driving like a mini cooper well, so... me estaba diciendo, me estaba diciendo, they reminded me, me estaba diciendo, you know how the teslas yeah. right like themselves but we're talking i don't know I, I don't know if it was true or not but because sometimes Monchi will tell me stuff and like he sounds so serious and i'm like oh no way and he'll be like laughing now, you're stupid, you know, like, <laughs> <laughs> it's not true. But I think this one, he was telling me like, that the Teslas, if you don't pay them, like, let's say you miss a few payments or whatever, and they're repossessing yeah. it, that they'll just have the car drive back alone to the dealership. Yeah. Do that. yeah. Really? So I was cool. like, what just, the fuck? Just the way that a Tesla can pick you up in front of the store. Yeah, like the fucking... Yeah, it does that. <laughs> it's computer. So what it is, it's it's a computer, the yeah. car. Yeah. So you can basically do whatever you can to that vehicle. You can put like, you can set up music for it so the doors can open to the music. Everything. So basically, if the car has to be repoed, they just have to put in their codes in the computer, and the car just, drives itself. Imagine that you. I was telling you, imagine you go to work and you're all like, "Fuck it, pues ni modo." you know pay it whenever and then you come out and your car's not even there anymore <laughs> it's driving nothing like, we're going <laughs> for real is it true i was cracking up i was like that's fucking crazy yeah so yeah like it's scary i don't know like you don't know i don't know what to think like because there's this guy that literally saw her 10 minutes ago when he when she left there dude apparently she was in another accident Watching the movie, the movie, watching the video of her driving so fast, and then you just hear cr like crashing, it just did it doesn't make sense, you know, because there it was it's a residential like area, you shouldn't be going that fast. And then, dude, like to me, like my question is, why would you put her in a body bag if she wasn't dead yet? Yeah, like let's say, for example, you know me, right? And I have three DWIs. And that's going to be in my record. So let's say somebody was trying to kill me. What would they use so that it looked bad on me? Oh, yeah. well, she was an alcoholic. She had drinking problems. No, she was on marijuana and she was uh, drinking. Stone and, drinking. and you're going to believe it. Why? <clears throat> because my background says it. And I don't know. There's a lot of things. But I don't know. We, we never know what that's sad. really went down. I'm only her. It is sad. It's crazy. Like, los kids de ella que dejó. They asked uh, Ellen DeGeneres, like, what do you have to say to about, you know, Aunt Hesh and her accident? And she was like, oh, like, like nothing. Como que, como que no le, como que no le pudo mucho. Like, eh. 
Y eso dicen que le pasó con la first girlfriend uh -huh. que se le murió a Helen. <clears throat> she was actually dating her when she died in a car accident also. And they were asking her, like, how does she feel? And she was like, eh. I'm like, what? That's crazy. Hey, guys, make sure to go and follow us. We are all over social media, Facebook, Instagram. We do have a TikTok as well. It's F-I-N adulting at in adulting and um you know if you do want to appear on our show we would love to have you as a guest so give us a dm um obviously follow us review us we're all over um you know anywhere you can find podcasts you would be able to find us just effing adulting like i said and give us a follow and just review our show i hope you guys are doing fantastic and let's go ahead and continue with the show my mom's addicted to tiktok now my aunt's addicted to tiktok she keeps sending me all these videos dude and she's like los estoy guardando and i'm like okay let you say something like that you know and i'm like all right next thing you know she's gonna be doing like the trends like the little dancing ones and i like to do them <laughs> I like to watch it, but not that much because I know I'll get addicted. Because <clears throat> once you switch for first three, you're like, oh, okay. Oh, all right. And you keep going. You should and going. try this. Y luego te sale el way. Hold on. Even, you know, like the guy that says to stop and like to take a break and all this shit. Yeah. I'm like, fuck you, dude. Fuck you. <laughs> who the fuck asked you? I need, who told you I needed a break, bitch? I know, and then you're all posting videos too. I've been seeing your videos too. I'm like, oh my god, hey, I forgot to tell you. I haven't smoked all day today. No so way. That's... Obviously, I have to give up smoking, you know? Oh, I can't be smoking oh. while pregnant. So I did. I had my last cigarette in the morning. And then today, I'm like, uh. Yeah. Okay, let me not do it in front of you. Oh, no, I don't care about that. Oh, okay. It just reminded me. It just reminded me. It just, yeah, that's why I'm like, damn it. Like, I, the last thing I want to do is remind you, you know. No, it's that's okay. Good, though. That's good. How you feel, though? I feel like I want to go have a cigarette. <laughs> don't do it. But it's because I'm doing it cold turkey, you know, like. Well, it sucks. It takes like, balls, dude. It honestly does take balls. I'm like, oh my god, and I've done that already, like for a good time, you know. But oh, monchis también fuma, so it's hard, you know. Yeah, I. I know. And they said that No, I had a crazy friend do like I used to work with in Petro, and she was pregnant. Yeah. Even now, but um. Oh. She would smoke, dude, and it's not like, oh, no, dos cigarros al día. No, dude, she would literally smoke, like, two packs a day. She was bad, dude, and her baby looked fine. They came out preemie, no, but, yeah, it came out little. Yeah. Yellow, but after that, like, the baby was okay, I guess. Mm. But, damn, like, for you to smoke like that much? Yeah, that's crazy. And I was, we would be able to smoke in petrol, remember, because it was out of a uh, Paso area. So yeah. we'll be in there. Emma smoke. Y lo se lo acababa five minutes later, otro. Mm. El otra vez, yo estoy. And I was like, oh, oh me daba esta. So, like, yeah, I smoke too, but not like that. You know? That's fucked up, dude. Wait, that's that's what you want to get pregnant? I don't know. Baby. Now I'm thinking about it with all that. Baby. 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 But I told her, I was like, you're waking up in the middle of the night if this does come through. No, ahorita, but it's gonna be like, ay, mijo, mija. Waking up early. Oh, no sé. Ya, cuando crezca, eh, cabrón. Vámonos de aquí, ya. Ya, ya, ya. Ya tienen 12 años, ya pueden solos. Vamos a ver, ¿cómo va? Ay, ay, yo cuando tenía 12 años, yo cuando tenía 14, vendía chocolates. Ándale. 
¿O no se va a vender? Yo a los nueve años me moví de la casa de mi mamá. Vámonos de aquí. Y me ha hecho Ten, aquí te compré unos chicles para que te pongas a vender. Ten el puente. Si no me vendes a ti, vengas para atrás. Y luego que regresé. ¿Estás listo? ¿Tú would have a baby, Crystal? I probably would. Se me antoja a veces. Sí. Oh. No, 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 to heal. Mm -hmm. I heard that if you heal right, they let you go home that night. Pues, te quedas un I mean, día, dos pues, días, pero si te sale todo mal por allá, pues, te quedas casi una semana. Yo de mi primer hijo duré una semana. Se me abrió toda. Okay. <laughs> y, ¿Sí? Uh -huh. That's crazy. Oh, you know. Pues, sí, tengo que coser y lo... Pero, ¿Te hicieron tear o te cortaron a ti? No, todo, se me rompió todo. Y... Oh, it's their head. Uh, luego, le digo a pinche Monchi, le digo, you're fucking, you have a big ass head, babe. Like, imagine, pobrecita yo. Está bien cabezón el güey. Le digo, pobrecita, me hace, le hace, pues, que te corten. Le digo, no, que te corten. Ay, le digo, si me rompe él. Sí. Ah, le digo. That happens, that's what like, I've seen. I'm just gonna tell him, you know what? Just fucking do it already. I know he's gonna have a big head. <laughs> just cut me already. Ya, tenga, mira, tenga. Yo traje mi own knife. Yo, ya me corté yo. Mire, ya, ya vengo, ya me corté yo. Yo estaba shaking. Ya me corté yo. Ya me que te, ya me ¿Por qué? Porque yo sé que va a venir cabezón. Mira el papá cómo está. <laughs> <laughs> and they'd probably be like, what? You're all bleeding out. <laughs> I, I know. You're crazy. I'm a DJ. Try and fill the void inside. I'd be lying if I didn't say that sounds nice. Wake up. Check your phone. But the batteries died.